I think the most heartbreaking aspect of the vaccination rollout so far has been the nursing homes. Um, we have had 1,560 people die in nursing homes so far during this crisis. Just about 360 people have died uh, in the last month in nursing homes. Now, there was a two-week delay uh, from when we got the vaccine to which the first vaccine was administered in a nursing home. Stephen Soon Donnelly stated that all of the, the residents and workers within nursing homes will be vaccinated by the end of January. There's still 3,000 people today in nursing homes that haven't had the first vaccine. Indeed, 20% of all nursing homes have, have not had the second vaccine, so we're not fully inoculated uh, yet. The, the fact but, that there are, there are reasons for that. Listen, there, there, there are going to be major difficulties in rolling out something like that. There's no doubt about it. But the, the key issue here is I've been speaking to many nursing homes over the last number of weeks, and they've told me that it has just come too late for many people. So we've heard of four or five major uh, outbreaks in nursing homes just in the last week where more than a dozen in, in each have people have lost their lives. And those people, it was just before they actually received the vaccine or just after they received it. Even uh, nursing homes uh, for religious orders, they're not even listed down as to receive the vaccination in, in this particular rollout, which is an absolute disgrace as well. You know, the, the nursing homes have been the, the most uh, vulnerable and the most exposed in the, this government's uh, plan.